To no surprise to anyone, Ratalos is back. Here we can look at the full armor set and weapon. Backhop is back. Same as Perfect Rush, on the other hand, some other basic moves weren't show at all for some reason, like Advancing Slash, Lateral Slash, or Round Slash, so there is a small chance they changed some of them or they just decided to not show these specific attacks for the time being. Coming back into Perfect Rush, we got a quick glimpse of it right at the start of the video and some more a little bit before the end, but we didn't have the chance to see the finisher. If you remember, Perfect Rush finisher in World had super strong attack that used to launch you away but in Rise they changed it to have three different variations and all of them can loop into backhop for another Perfect Rush or pretty much any other attack you desire. Right after the presentation of the weapon we get to see a new move that allows you to quickly reposition a bit and even move sideways. Looking that there are some different variations of these quick steps, my guess is, that this a mechanic that works changing the direction of the joystick after any basic sword attack, similar to how World's SNS repositioning worked. Triple Shield Bash is still the same as before. After that, the Hunter does a move similar to Ryze's Sliding Slash but this time you can combo quickly into another attack, unlike the old version that directly launches you in the air for a falling bash. But I don't think this time it will have any iframes because those worked only while airborne and that is gone, instead it seems to be just a repositioning tool. We can still use items with the weapon drawn. Now we get into focus mode. Here the hunter does a stab animation and go directly into falling bash, a quick after that we get to see a new guard counter that chains into an horizontal attack. I don't recognize it from the old games so it seems to be also a new move. And finally we get to see SNS doing a stance that goes into a jumping stab animation. I would love to see if we are gonna have some different choices after a successful counter but we will have to wait and see. We got to see some interesting new mechanics for the SNS, that for sure will change how this weapon plays from previous iterations. I can't wait to try it out for myself. One move I wasn't that excited though, is the first move shown for the focus mode. Since we used to have so many different variations of Falling Bash already. In Rise we used to have, Back Hop into Falling Bash, Metsu into Falling Bash, Sliding Slash into Falling Bash, and even Wirebug moves could chain into it. But since the last three are gone or were changed, it kinda makes sense to have it tied to another move. It looks that the fast and frenetic playstyle of Rise is gone in favor of a more slow methodical approach this time but we will have to experience it ourselves to get a better picture of how the combat will actually be. I don't see Perfect Rush being super broken again, at least like it was in World, since it was already nerfed in Rise, both in damage as well as in speed, but it will probably still be viable. Can't wait to see what Capcom will show next in a couple of weeks when we finally get to see the first demos in action.